All right, so you guys know when it comes to editing softwares, there are so many different options, but the big thing is a lot of them end up costing a ton of money, whether that's a monthly subscription and upfront payment. Editing in general is a super expensive hobby to get into, but I'm actually going to be showing you guys Wondershare Filmora because it's one of the best free editing softwares that allows you to fully edit your own YouTube videos with ease for free. So if you guys do enjoy the video, you want to go check out Filmora using the link at the top of the description as well as a pinned comment, go do that. But like, comment, subscribe. Let's just get right into the tutorial all right guys so like i said in the intro this is actually wondershare filmora it's one of the best free editing softwares out there on the entire internet and uh, i'm gonna have a link at the top of the description as well as a pinned comment for you guys to check this out so you don't have to look it up um but like you can see free download for windows 11 and below um it shows all the main features on the website so if you're on the fence about getting this software in the first place you're able to just go over to the website without even committing to anything go through you know some of the different features you're able to preview what it has and then you're also able to kind of see what those effects look like which is super Super cool they have enhanced keyframing motion tracking speed revamp all of this stuff is just insane they have some new ai tools and uh yeah what more to do than uh for me to check out filmora so i'm gonna boot it up and i'll see you guys once i'm inside of there okay so once we're actually inside of filmora all we have to do is go here to new project and open it up and this will actually fire up a new project for us to get started now the ui of filmora which is one of the things i love the most it's super user friendly and you're able to kind of have zero editing experience going into this and just know what you're doing basically just by it, it it just makes it super easy to understand the software and how to actually operate it so what i'm going to be doing is i'm going to find some sort of footage um to actually use for this so i'm gonna let my footage folder load for a second here um i'm just kind of waiting but uh, let me quickly overview some of the features here so in the top left is kind of our media pool this is our timeline this is our previewer and this is where we actually edit the effect um, settings so up here we can see that we're given media which is what we'll upload our media to we're given stock media as well in the filmora server which is really cool we're given audio to access which is like songs effects all that stuff um titles transitions effects filters stickers and templates which is really cool that a free editing software has all of this so for example i'm gonna upload some sample youtube footage that i have um so we're gonna drag it in right here and the cool thing is it's actually able to auto sync the project settings to the media that we're using so we can see right Right here they were given the option we can see that it'll preview just like that so this is like a sample recording of my own um and i'm gonna show you guys how to use it so starting off the big thing with intros is cutting out dead space now for more makes this super easy because you're able to actually preview the audio waveforms down here so we're able to see the gaps in audio that we want to cut out so all we have to do is navigate our playhead to wherever there's a gap and press the scissor button so we can go here scissor go here boom press that again let's say we want to go all the way over to like here cut that boom cut that select this delete come all the way over here select this delete like we're given the ability to just cut out dead space easily and it will automatically move it over so you don't have to worry about dragging it over after so we can see that the gap here so that's like kind of like it, it gets rid of that gap so it's super cool this is how you actually do the cutting of your videos itself and it literally takes like two seconds to actually do this so just like that boom we can delete all the dead space and it takes like two seconds so i highly suggest that if you're literally just looking to cut stuff filmora is going to be a really good pick for you okay now for like stock media for example we're given all of these different options now this would be great if you were kind of talking about something in the intro for example you wanted to kind of have some sort of background where it you know shows something but then it has a background so you could have like text here or something like that it gives you so many different options there's gradients there's like solid colors there's these weird like tacky designs which are kind of cool to use if you need them they have like some super sophisticated designs they got like a few moments later like that kind of stuff um so it's really cool you're actually able to do that you're able to just download it and then from there you upload it um um, so that's super cool that you could do that and it gives a bunch of different things right here so you got like intro outro car money whore like there's so many different options for this um so you can use this for like tiktok videos youtube videos intros all that stuff super cool now moving on to audios every single youtube video needs good audio and background music so this just having a library in general is amazing these are all the trending titles um we can go to hip-hop right here and it will actually just load up there you go cool guy ai music so that's like super cool. So our, just like that, we already have a song that we can drag in the background. So boom, just like that. And then we can adjust the volume literally 
with like in a matter of five seconds so we got music in the background super cool um titles if we wanted to do some subtitling we're able to do that so we're given a bunch of different layer styles which is super cool um so for example i could just literally go like this drag this in like you know do different ones like copy paste make a different subtitle layer make this one say like yo make this one say like guys or something like that and then you'd be able to like have it change words kind of thing and have it progressively just kind of go one by one by one and subtitle your entire video that would be super cool that you're able to do that now if you want to for example let's say you have a piece of stock footage in here um it's got to download it real quick to actually be able to use it but let's say you have the stock footage and it pops up you don't want it to just straight pop up because that ruins the flow of the video and it's not gonna look super attractive so what we can do is we can trim this down we can go over to transitions and we can use the dissolve so then that way instead of going um like a straight cut into the thing like this or just go straight into it we're able to soften that by putting a dissolve on it which will bring it up or like a warp zoom which we're able to do that if we want to boom that's a really cool option um if we also wanted some effects like rgb stroke you can apply that which is super cool they got like glitches that you can add on like over top so like this dude there are just so many the possibilities are like endless with this software you're given so many different things so like trendy new there's like these 3d overlays for like metaverse um devil horns hallucination effects light leaks all that stuff it's amazing now we got video effects here just like rgb split some noise texture some shakes here some zoom some flickers glitch opening closing blur border dude look how many different subsections there are and that's just video and they have body effects which is for like masking out people we got audio effects as well they got this new blue effects boris effects um which is like a very popular style which is a very popular plugins company now filters you're also able to add like these color correction things which are super cool you can kind of see the slight difference between those um texture brown for example we could like drag that in that's super cool um but there are just so many different options that you'd normally have with any other editing software but this one's 100 free now we have all these different media overlays as well like like comment subscribe like dude i don't know any other editing software that has that built into the software which is crazy we have all these different subscribe animations we have like these different social media ones like thanks for watching subscribe like all that stuff all these tiktok overlays dude it's just crazy these are on the software itself now that's not even including the templates templates are actually really cool because we're actually given this like the subscribe now thanks for watching but the cool thing is which i'll show you guys in a second so for example if we drag in the thanks for watching we can double click on it and from there we're able to change the text you can see thanks for watching um we can go like thanks for watching the vid which is a little long but you know you're able to change it which is super cool now subscribe to joshy or something like that if we wanted to um it's a that's a little bit long um so we're not gonna do that probably but um yeah it's super cool that we're actually given that option it's really cool but um yeah that is that there we can save it uh we're given that option for literally all these they're all able to be edited um these logos you can replace it with images from your computer these youtube intros for gamers all of that stuff you're given an option for all these subscribe animations these call to actions they're all editable which is super cool and is a great feature for if you're a youtuber you want to start out and you don't know how to do like all this advanced editing where you're making your own templates um there are just a there are just a ton of different um sections for this so it's really cool that we're able to do that and then for example if we were to want to wrap up the video here for example let's say we've done all the editing we want to we can cut it and then what we can do delete all the excess then we come up here to export and then once we press the export button we're actually able to pick what we render this out as so we'd pick it as like final filmora test something like that um and then we'd pick the folder we want to save it to so i save all my full all my videos to the youtube folder preset we can actually edit the um, presets here so i'm going to edit this to 1920 by 1080 60 fps uh h264 encoder my bitrate i'm going to change to 20,000 kilobytes per second uh audio stuff i can leave the same i'm going to go to apply and then what i'm going to do is i'm going to go to export now this is going to export it and we're also able to directly export it to youtube instagram facebook twitter so much more um that's really cool that it actually allows us to do this which is really really cool um so i'm just going to quickly show you after it renders super easy i'm just going to be able to go to where i just rendered it out to um and then this is the full version of the video so we can see like this and it has like our little like transition that we put in but it's super high quality 
and we can see that that is actually what it gives us to do and we didn't even have to do like any extreme editing we just get, had a bunch of templates effects um but yeah that's basically how you could use filmora it's a super diverse and versatile software that you can literally start using for absolutely free today um so go download it using the link at the top of the description as well as a pinned comment um i'm super excited for you guys to actually learn how to use it i think it's an amazing software massive shout out to the people over at wondershare for making this video possible if you guys did enjoy make sure to like comment subscribe i will see you guys in a future video on the channel peace out